Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be filming a Zara haul. Before I get into the video, I just wanted to apologise for the absence. This is literally the first video I've uploaded in two months. And I literally have brown hair. What the hell? I feel like I needed a massive change. Like, I don't want to get deep on this video, but I just feel like I completely lost all of my motivation. I was just like living the same life every single day i couldn't be bothered filming i couldn't be bothered editing and it's really sad i feel like i just lost like the reason why i started doing these videos and stuff but i feel like now i've got new hair i can finally get on with my life i don't know what it is with girls like why do we always need to change our hair color when we need a change in our life i don't know but anyway i'm gonna be filming a zara haul um this is gonna be sort of like a basic autumn zara haul so everything that i picked up from zara is essential like you literally need these pieces in your wardrobe they're so versatile everything i bought i actually bought in store so i either got it from the zara in manchester or i got it from the zara in london me and charlie went to london a couple of weeks ago and i picked up quite a few things i am literally obsessed with zara i feel like everyone is obsessed with zara at the minute i'm just gonna get straight on in with the video so if you do enjoy this video please smash a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe thought it'd be a lot easier just to hang it up i've seen quite a few people film videos like this and it just literally seems so much easier and I can literally just pick it off and show you so the first thing that I'm going to show you is this nude blazer I've literally wanted this blazer for the longest time but it's like 60 pound I'm like I don't want to pay 60 pound for a blazer even though it's so worth it I knew that I needed it in my wardrobe because I've only got black blazers and I just needed a nude blazer but I couldn't find a nice one anywhere but as well I feel like when you've got your heart set on something you just have to bite the bullet and go for it but um in my case charlie actually bought this place for me so thanks charlie because i probably wouldn't have bought it myself i feel like it's going to be hard to show you like what it looks like because my camera is on the ottoman right now amazing setup i know it honestly it's so so nice and i feel like it suits this hair so much more than it does blonde hair like no offense if you've got the blazer and you've got blonde hair it still looks amazing but i just feel like with dark hair it just I don't know there's just something about it i got this in a size extra small it is quite an oversized fit so when i tried it on in the shop i tried on a small i wanted it oversized but the, the small was like absolutely humongous so i swapped it for an extra small and this one fits perfectly the next piece that i picked up was this black body warmer gilet body warmer i'm probably going to say this about every single piece but i've wanted one of these fridges as well the only thing with this is they only had it in a small and i really wanted it to be an oversized fit so this is what it looks like on i don't know if you can see it very well but it is actually quite short it only comes up to here um so that's the reason why i wanted to get it a little bit more oversized it is quite a thin material the next few things that i picked up were actually these two shirts I feel like every single girl in the whole entire world owns these shirts, especially the pink one. Um, I actually bought the white one quite a while ago in my last Zara haul, but it wasn't the oversized one. So I decided to buy this one. This one is the oversized one. These shirts are only $19.99, which I think is really, really cheap for a shirt. Um, they do actually have a blue one as well, which is so nice. It does give me work vibes, so I don't know if I'm going to buy it, but it is really, really nice. But... I love these shirts because I think you can just throw them over any outfit. I usually wear them with like a unitard or like a co-ord, but I am going to take them on holiday with me to wear over a bikini. I'm not going to try them on because they are really, really creased and they do actually need washing because I wear them quite often. I literally, I'm obsessed with these shirts. Like everyone is obsessed with shirts at the minute, but they're just so easy and so good to just throw over an outfit, especially with the weather recently. It's not been cold, but it's not been warm. So I feel like this is the perfect thing to throw over. The next top that I got was just this black rim crop top this is actually part of a co-ord but unfortunately they didn't have the leggings in store when i actually picked this up i do actually have some rib leggings from stradivarius and they're pretty much identical so i can wear it with that the top that i have to match the leggings from stradivarius is actually a long sleeve top um and i just really really wanted a t-shirt one to go with it so i picked this one up also before i forget to mention the top i'm wearing i actually picked up when i bought all this stuff as well so this is just a basic plain black crop t-shirt you can just wear these with anything same with the next two tops that i'm going to show you um so i got again black and white i bought both of these racinette crop tops i was unsure whether to get these ones or the ribbed ones um but i thought these ones felt like really really good quality again 3.99 like 3.99 when you see something in zara that's 3.99 you have to buy it i just wish they did more colors in these i didn't actually see 
any more colours and I wish they did do. They probably do do more colours. Do do. Do do. I don't know why that makes me laugh so much but it does. But again, I think these are a must have in your wardrobe. They're just so simple and so nice as well. I've actually been wearing these under the shirts. They look really, really nice with like some shorts or you can wear leggings, jeans. And I just feel like they add a little bit of something to an outfit because they're not a t-shirt. They're a vest. If that makes any sense. Now, again, I feel like everyone is obsessed with the same things at the minute. Green. The colour green. I am literally obsessed. I need that green tracksuit from Zara and the, it was nowhere to be seen. It's sold out online, so I can't get it from there. I'm just stressing. But I actually went into Zara and I found this green racer ribbed crop top. Oh my god. I love it so much. I just think green is such a gorgeous colour. I've never actually owned anything green before. Like, I'm quite proud of myself for getting some colour in this haul um, because I'm normally just, like, queen of black and white. I literally love this top. They had it in other colours, like nudes, but I've got quite a few nude crop tops, so I'm saying that, and I've bought, like, five black and white crop tops, but £3.99. Like, what the hell? A lot of people are wearing, like, pink and green together, which I think looks amazing. Um, I've actually just bought a dress from Sheen, which is pink, and I bought some green heels and a green bag to go with it. I know this is not a Sheen haul, but I'm just going to show you the heels because I'm obsessed. I've never bought heels from Sheen before. Sorry, I'm talking really fast because I'm getting really excited. I love them. I love them. So these are the shoes. The heel is a lot smaller than I thought it was going to be, but this is what they look like at the front. I am literally obsessed. My camera is flashing at me. I'm really sad right now like a flip-flop but then it's got this little detail in which I think just adds a little bit more and then I bought this green bag to match those heels were like 15 pound and this bag was like four pound the next thing that I picked up was this blue halter neck crop top let me just sort this out on the hanger so you can see I'll insert a picture of me wearing this so you can see what it looks like properly but this was only 20 pound it's a cowl neck satin top and then it ties around the back like this so it ties around your neck and around your back I actually bought this for my birthday me and Charlie went to York that vlog is going to be up after this one but I actually bought this to wear on my birthday but I was really really struggling to pair it with anything I know it matches jeans but when I put the outfit on I just I didn't think any pair of jeans that I owned matched the style of the top so I was having like a mental breakdown and I just didn't want to wear the top so um I actually wore it when I went to Newcastle with Morgan again I did a vlog for that video which will be up in a couple of weeks I decided to wear it with some black pants instead and I just feel like it looked so much better and then the last thing that I picked up was just a pair of jeans um this is a pair of straight leg jeans I actually bought these two sizes bigger than my usual size so i'm usually a size 8 i bought them in a size 12. um i didn't actually buy them in a 10 but zara sizing is literally horrific um so a size 10 was more like an 8 which i was like okay so i actually bought these in a size 12. they are really really oversized and i feel like since i bought them i've lost a little bit of weight so i feel like they're too big to wear now which is a massive shame um, but again, I'll insert a picture of me wearing these jeans so that you can see what they look like. Just fit so nice. They're so comfortable. And the way that they sit on your trainers at the bottom is just like everything that I've wanted. I always see girls wearing jeans with trainers and I just wanted to be a girl wearing jeans with trainers. Do you know what I mean? That were like mom style jeans. The bottom of the jean just sits on the trainer nicely. And I finally found a pair. I would literally recommend these jeans to anyone. And they're only £27.99, which is an absolute bargain. Even though I did buy everything from store, I will try and find it on the website. And I will link it down below in case you are interested in buying anything. But other than that, that is the end of the video. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, smash a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.